guys and welcome back to another episode of medieval dynasty so today uh, i wanted to get a couple more of those main quest lines done uh but i also crafted up some knives and i forgot to put them in here apparently so just noticed that when i was looking at my inventory um i also started crafting up baskets uh last night i crafted up 30 they're about 20 dollar or 20 each so they're probably about half that so if we look at the price that's probably about you know what i have no bloody idea how much that's gonna be worth uh rough estimate 300 i guess possibly um might be about 300 i don't know i i don't know what the um return rate on those are actually it could be ten dollars it could be something a little bit more it could be less let's go uh well we're on our way over to another town anyways so we might as well stop in there uh there's a shop that we can sell these baskets to and i mean it's on our way already right so there's no point in worrying about it and then we'll find out what the uh, actual price of these baskets are worth. Obviously, it's not going to be twenty dollars, but or twenty gold, but it'll be maybe ten at the most or the least. I don't know. Maybe we'll find out. It's also autumn now. Uh, if you haven't noticed with the leaves, well, it's a little hard to notice with the leaves, I guess, because it's pretty rainy out at the moment. Okay, she's the one that we have to go to, and I have to locate. You. Hail, friend. Whatever you need, I've got it. All right. So yeah, it's exactly half the price. So get like three hundred from that, and um, that's not bad for just a few sticks. Have a good day. All right. So her, we want to talk to her. There's also some interesting things here. All right. Uh, let's see here. I'd uh. Take a hike. Uh, don't even tell me about. Uh, pretty sure this is the quest that I have to do the riddle with. Uh,
Alright, so at the moment, what I'm working on is trying to get uh, a lot of mushrooms for um, selling. Uh, we don't actually have a lot on us at the moment. If we go to our inventory, we got... Um, like, I remember the... What was it? The, these ones going for like a dollar each or whatever. So we have about like 50... Uh, four dollars right there. I think the other ones are a little bit less possibly But uh, I'm just trying to pick as many mushrooms as I can and we'll see if we can't get um, a Decent price for them, but I did upgrade the bartering so we might get a little bit more than we did last year um, Not entirely sure about that, but well, I'm hoping that we will I'm just trying to find all the uh, the mushroom sites. I can't remember where they all are uh, there's another mushroom over here, a couple of them. I've been using the, um, what do you call it, the viewer thing in order to find them. So, it's basically what I'm doing is I'm just hopping in and out to grab them. And there's looks like there's a lot of these ones up here. Still trying to find them all. There's a few other smaller ones. Right, there's those. I don't really need any of those. Uh, there's another mushroom down here. This might go a little bit more uh, this year because we've got the bordering, but... We'll see. There's another one right here, but we have to pick up some sticks. <laughs> sticks are always getting in the way for um, collecting them. There's these ones. They These ones might go for a little bit. There is quite a few of them, so... And I have like 40 of them now, so... Um, what else? I, I, we might actually want to build a herbologist or herbalist um, building. There is somebody in extraction. I think it's extraction that you need somebody in one of those. And there is a, a guy that could that is in one of these towns that are actually good at extraction. So we might be able to do that. Um, at the moment, though, I think we might be able to put them in the shed here. I'm not sure yet. We, we'll see what we can do. Let's go to... We got skills. We got, uh... Oh, we got two of them. I didn't realize that we got two points, not just one. Um...
I almost entirely forgot that we had all this uh, crops just sitting here uh, ready for harvesting. So <laughs> we'll go ahead and uh, harvest these right now and then we can start making some food up. Uh, we do have one of our people in extraction, so we'll be able to get some more stuff for Dob, but uh, Dob doesn't go for too much, I don't think. I think you can purchase it at a high price, but it doesn't really go for much more than what it's actually worth, so. Um, but we did get bartering uh, for two points, so we might be able to get a little bit better deal on it. Alright, so I'm getting a little bit encumbered with all this stuff, so I'm going to move that to the house. And we'll just put it on the floor for the time being. Yeah, you definitely can notice the uh, the speed for which the player runs when they're going sideways. But I do notice that it also um, drains a lot more um, energy as well. So. Okay, so put those two down there for the time being. And if I can get outside the door, that'd be great. We'll end up going and harvesting some more carrots, and we have more cabbage over there, and some beets as well. So, we've got tons of food. We can probably start selling food as well, so... Uh, given that we have enough bulls to do that with. Okay, so these are the beet roots. Probably start getting heavy around now. Possibly, I'm not sure. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so we'll probably make it to the end of this roll, row, and then we have a little bit more that we have to carry. Um, but outside of seeds, how did we do for... We got 36 and 36 for the cabbage, and... Well, cabbage we don't... 31 for the carrots. So, we basically doubled our um <clears throat> our seed count and so i'm gonna put this over here and we'll pick up the carrots got a lot of carrots that's good all right and then we have some beetroots as well oh i just ate it by accident Alright, and we still have a little bit more cabbage that we need to collect. And then we can start fertilizing the um, soil and stuff. Now, did I not? I guess I didn't have enough um, cabbage seeds to go all the way down there. We should have them next year, though.
All right, guys. So I got uh, the sickle back. We did get the sickle back for the um, I don't know the governor or whatever the guy is, um, which is basically good. That was the one of the harder ones. Now we have to go back to Sam, uh, which I rem kind of remember we needed to get food for him, but um, I can't remember what the amounts are or uh, what the products were. <laughs> I know we have beetroots, we have extra cabbage, we have extra carrots, so I just don't know if there's anything else that we need. I know it's not meat, but... Um... Oh, and I got the uh, two buildings over here done. I started working on the um, resource or the extraction shed, so this one. We got a couple of the walls uh, done, that one and that one, but we still have those ones. Then we can start working on probably the barn next and get that one all settled. There's just the uh, exterior walls by the looks of it. There isn't any roof roofing that we need to work on or anything like that. And then there's this one, which um, a storage shed, which has a little bit more uh, with the panels up there, but uh, pretty much the same size almost. A little bit bigger, but about the same size. Uh, it's like two walls bigger or something like that with the back walls, but that's not too bad. Anyhow, uh, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.